tracing means uh, one protocol come Very good evening, everyone. Okay, friends. So today, uh, today I think uh, we will reach. Uh, we'll reach uh, with the teaching syllabus. I think this week. Yeah. Today I will finish uh, optical instrument. Tomorrow I'll teach way optics, things uh, way optics. Okay, friends, very important. Listen. So today our uh, topic, last topic of the ray optics is optical instruments. I'm requesting uh, listen carefully. Why? Because in your board exam also, long answer type questions will come. Yeah, derivation will come. So very useful and. Uh, JE point of view also questions will come every year coming. If you, you can have a check also exam side up. Let us see first of all, simple microscope. Simple microscope. Simple microscope, it is also called uh, in our normal language magnifying glass. And very, another name in a common language, convex lens, simply. You can see this kind of uh, simple microscope in the librarian, old librarian hand, old scientist hand. In your childhood also, in your geometric box, uh, compulsory one small magnifying glass will be given. You might be played also. You might be focused the image of sun onto your friend's skin. Correct or not? Played or not? Yes, sir. Not played. Huh? Not played. Huh? This is a convex lens. This is your friend's skin. This is an image. Of, this is an object. I mean, sun. When the light rays are coming uh, from and falling on the convex lens, you attempted to focus that uh, image of the sun on your friend's skin. For one minute, uh, if you focus like that, na, you will get uh, immediate uh, irritation. I mean, it will burning sensation immediately you will get and then he start chasing you and uh, so one kilometer he will chase you and he will kick you. And also you can burn the that magicians in the countryside. Na. So, in, to convince the people, to cheat the people 
they will keep one uh, what do you say phosphorus in one paper and his assistant secretly will focus that uh, uh, image of the sun on the paper when you tell om beam beam bush means automatically it will burn correct or not understood so all people will start thinking you know this a uh, black magic understood so to believe the uh, super power some like that so uh, his business will improve uh, uh, to convince the people he is a great he has some super powers correct or not uh, yes yes okay so that is called simple microscope what is the major purpose of the simple microscope come on tell me to magnify the image if you are a librarian so the font size as your age is growing you are unable to see the read the font size properly na no? that's what that librarian if they keep that book where they have to keep the book tell me this is a point of focus this object i mean the book must be kept where come on respond if the book you kept between optic center and point of focus what will happen what will happen respond students so one virtual image will form what is the nature of the virtual image highly magnified highly magnified that's what to magnify the image so uh, you have to use the ordinary convex lens or simple microscope understood what is the magnification power or magnification of the convex lens i'm requesting everyone what is the magnification power or magnification of the lens height of the image by height of the object already that we discussed now here after some different uh, things will act now we can define magnification power or magnification magnification power equal to visual angle visual angle with the aid aid means what with this convex lens divided by visual angle without aid understood our students so kindly remember this formula at your fingertips very important student <clears throat> now if you see uh, you are watching one arrow generally in your laboratory have you stepped in your optics laboratory have you performed any activity ah yeah? oh, yes sir okay if you perform activity your physics instructor must be given one iron nail to you as a object one sharp iron nail is there he will treat like a object here lighta okay i think that is a very conventional method but right now trend changed right now i mean well equipped right now latest one that is gone actually burning candle white pep no okay no no generally so you have you have dark laboratory ha no no dark that yeah i understood now i understood so i think that is a uh, before before 25 years my teachers also used to show like that now still now i realize <laughs> okay very good that is only good okay so listen now the thing is students uh, you take one iron nail this is who means what iron nail or arrow you are watching with your naked eye you are a observer let's say the height of the object how much ho and what is the object distance from your eye and object you understanding ah yes, so you did not use any aid no aid means what any convex lens or any spectacles or microscope telescope you did not use no kindly say sir no then join the your eye and uh, the head of the arrow this angle between 
horizontal line and the tip of the arrow is called what visual angle without aid theta not is called what here visual angle with aid and divided by visual angle without aid visual angle without aid how much with your permission shall i write uh, all small approximate angles as tan of theta not ah, yes, i told now we are uh, discussing yes, only para axial rays angles are very very little so for all little angles i can write theta not equal to how much tan of theta not so that is how much opposite side by adjacent side says or no so very important equation kindly remember at your fingertips understood us friends and now now uh, you used the aid aid means what you used the convex lens with aid this is without aid without aid and what is this kindly respond with aid with aid okay so i kept one object here one ray of light falling how it will go please respond it must and should pass through the point of focus and one more ray of light passing at optic center it goes like this they are own deviate but where they will meet wait a second actually they should not meet i'll draw properly because the refracting light rays this is a convex lens where you have to keep the object students between optic center and point of focus one ray of light falling how it will refract compulsory point of focus any ray of light falling at optic center will it undergo any refraction no do they meet these emerging or emanating light rays do they meet i am questioning you they do not meet but uh, virtually they will meet say yes or no virtually they will meet somewhere understood by this is object by adjusting the position of the object and convex lens you are watching here you are an observer you are watching the image right by adjusting the position of the object students the image can be formed how many places image can be formed at infinite if the final image is formed at infinite that point is called a normal adjustment position students what is that normal adjustment position i will tell you that is called least strained eye normal adjustment or far point generally the image will be formed at infinite location then only your eye will be relaxed understood so this is called far point or relaxed eye also which i relaxed eye also can be called if when image is farer when image is form have you noticed i told i suggested many times when you are continuously studying for every 40 minutes you go outside and see the far object farer flying bird or farer tree farer sky did i tell or not doctors also will advise if for every weekend you go to outside what will happen scientifically when you are seeing farer objects your optical nerves will be relaxed are understanding student so your eye will be in the relaxed state but always continuously definitely 8 out of 10 software engineers will have the spectacles why continuously they have to see the nearest object when you are seeing nearest object what will happen your ciliary muscles will be elongated like a stretched rubber band lot of strain will come say yes or no that i called when the image is formed very close very near point that is called a strained eye are you understanding oh, where are the what is the location of major formation of images 
far point and near point. So far point, another name is called what, student? Relaxed eye. Another, another location what? Least distance of distinct vision. D means what here? Least distance of. Least distance of. Uh, I will explain. I will come to that point. Not only for your eye students. See right now. Am I seeing you? Am I seeing you? Wrong. I am not seeing you. I am seeing your image. You are also seeing my image. Hey, after few seconds of me, he can see. Oh. I will tell you. you see here. Sir, until you said this. Okay. Uh, yeah, I already told. Yeah, told the past, past, I am seeing uh. in past. Okay, so uh, see, listen here, friends. This is a convex lens. Max or sonar. Okay, so listen. Nothing is accurate. Okay, so listen. You are feeling that you are seeing the object. Actually, we are all are seeing the. No one can see the object. You are seeing the image of me. See here, this is me, and uh, your eye is having natural convex lens. Correct or not? Here, in your eye, one natural screen is there. That is called retina. Correct or not? Once light rays are coming from my face, falling in your natural convex lens, they are meeting at your retina. So, you are seeing my image, students. Actually, inside your eye, my image will be inverted. Then you will question me. Sir, why you are not uh, inverted, sir? Will you question me or not? Yes, sir. Then I have to answer or not. In the transportation of this image to your nervous system, neuron, who are sensing my image, neuron is sensing, neuron is addressing my image to your brain. Are you understanding? He is Ramesh, sir. Who is telling to you? Neuron. In the transportation of the image, so this optic nerve is there, na? In the transportation of the image, uh, one neuron is there. So, in that moment, that image will be inverted. Now, you tell me you are watching me or my image. My image only you are watching. I am watching you is wrong state. I am watching your image is the most accurate state. Not That is only accurate state. Now, tell me. Somebody has some image doesn't get inverted, then that person is inverted. Ah, that is also there. That is called distorted image. Yes, that distorted image means when they are seeing the sphere, they will argue with you that is not a sphere. It is cylinder, they will tell. Sir, not like that, sir. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, they are sitting there. Now, my Sometimes, my... occasionally it will happen. If optic nervous system failure means that rarely, that is not an ordinary disease, for one crore, one people it will have. Understood? Color blindness also. Now we are nicely seeing all types of colors. Some people do not, cannot see colors. Some people cannot see particular colors. You are giving red color means they will tell that is not red, green they will tell. That is not, they are not cracking joke. That is the deficiency. Uh, Mark Zuckerberg, I think, uh, yes. Uh, so, so, listen here, friends. Now, now, this is a convex lens. This is a convex lens. Now, just for a while, you imagine you are a librarian. Who are you? Librarian. librarian. So, where you have to keep the book? Where you have to keep the book? Between the you are using the your magnifying glass or simple microscope or convex lens. Where you have to keep that book? Focus focus. That book must be kept between optic center and point of focus. So, how the image will form? As I told you earlier, uh, 
definitely virtual image should form and highly magnified that's what that person is feeling comfortable using the magnifying glass his eye will not be strained what i am saying by changing this object position you can also change the image location also no says sir no correct or not every every i not only i every optical instrument whether your ia whether your spectacula whether your simple microscope whether your compounding microscope electronic microscope telescope whatever the instruments you are using every instrument is having two points what are the two points first point is called near point what is the name of that point near point near point means what compulsory and other point is far point for your better understanding i will use the real number students for every human being what is the nearest point distance healthy human being means uh, healthy human being means what whose eyes are normal normal health condition is there their nearest point how much 25 cm and what is the far point actually it is infinity but uh, to address you uh, to convince you some number i will give how many cm 700 cm students what is the difference between 25 and 700 how many times almost all 28 times how many times 28 times far point is how many times almost all approximately only i am telling how many times 28 times to that nearest point understood or not understood that's what you can say for a, a very large quantity you can assume in all numerical solvings and uh, uh, explanations far point will be taken as what here infinity i am telling here infinity also having some exact value if you are standing more than 7 meter i cannot see you properly correct or not that's what if you see auditorium with a specific dimensions only it will be there perfect auditorium or understanding student perfect auditorium having the perfect dimension depends on the image i mean screen size the distance between the audience and screen only it will be decided based on this concept only understood if you are seeing a very tiny object if the image is formed more than 7 meters can you see that now you are seeing me but you cannot identify me when i am more than 7 meters i am crying or smiling or laughing or you cannot observe me properly correct or not if image is formed below 25 cm more than 7 meters what will happen you cannot see a well defined image well resolution image you cannot see i am telling compulsory where the image must form where you must catch the image more than 25 cm and less than infinity 7 meters or infinity then only you can see the well defined high defined image students just to try can you able to read by keeping the book less than 25 cm now itself you will see you can see uh, try once you cannot you are just seeing you are not reading and uh, keeps more than 7 meters it is not possible na Uh, you yes, cannot see that, that. <laughs> not visible correct or not yes or no that not only that small letters uh, open the cover page front page seven uh, meter means you that also you cannot read more than seven meter are you understanding okay so what i am trying to say i mean scientist for every optical instrument your eye is also optical instrument says sir no 
why we are not conducting classes in auditoriums and exhibitions big big functionals why you can see good idea na all people coming at a time single teacher money also can be said why it is wrong idea they cannot see the board that's what a classroom has some perfect dimensions movie theater has some specific dimension her understanding ah uh, yes small letters so that's what so what i am trying to say when you feel more comfortable and when you can catch the well defined image compulsory very very important note i am giving student very very important note image must be caught virtual image image must be must be caught where in between in between where and where students near point and far point you got my point less than 25 cm the image will become blurry not well defined more than infinity also blurry and uh, that sharpness will miss sharpness is there na correct or not you are seeing image is visible but blurry sharpness contrast contrast is there na that is missing are you understanding say yes sir no when you are reading a and b letters you will you are i will sense that they are overlapped one it is uh, forming one different letter are you understanding what i am trying to say so it cannot uh, resolve the two letters properly unless if the image is formed between the nearest point and farthest point so the distance between nearest point and uh, optical instrument is called what here lddv what is the name of this lddv what is the meaning of lddv least distance of distinct vision distinct vision means what clear image will be formed at least that's what uh, you have to keep your book now also my laptop screen is more than 25 cm only if you observe no one will keep like this when is someone is watching like this means very severe eye issues are there with that person some old people you observe you they will keep the newspaper like this are you understanding your grandmother or anyone you go she will come and watch put to put her face very closely and they will recognize have you noticed da huh? grandmother are there ha huh? understood da huh? okay you observe them they will see like this why because what they are doing like this they are adjusting the size of the lens they are adjusting the image location in between the nearest point and far point i mean not with the hands so it, for them their age factor na so the response will be somewhat delay that's what the process will be they will take more time to take your image in between their near point and forest point response is slow are understand sometimes they might not recognize you also are understand one day uh, one day my i am went to my grandmother house i was standing here she could not recognize me hey who are you why oh, yeah. why because that is the eye problem right and are you understanding why because so they are what it is a jiva ha huh? ha huh? okay so listen compulsory what is the for well defined image image must be formed between the nearest point and farthest point what is the value of d tell me compulsory it must be 25 cm no if the image distance is less than 25 cm what will happen less. just you are seeing the image but not uh, clear blurred. cut one it is blurred or uh, ruptured image you can see blurry low contrast low sharpness image will be seen and if image distance is more than 7 meters also same kind of effects you can see friends okay compulsory every optical instrument must be maintained this two points here now uh, there are two points are there what a first point is called tell me far point what is another name of the far point tell me relaxed eye na say sir no relaxed eye is also called what here friends normal adjustment position 
normal adjustment means what? Your eye should be normal, no? Normal means how long do you see? You will not feel strain. Correct or not? Say yes or no? Okay. So that's what it is called normal adjustment position. In this normal adjustment position, this is the optic center. This is the point of focus. I kept the object at exactly on the point of focus. So the light rays will be what here, students? Infinity, na? Where they will meet? Where they will meet virtually? Infinity location. Infinity means what, students, here? Infinity or another magnifying, another numerical value, how much? 7 meter. What is the name of this point here, students? Far point. What is the name of the point? Far point. Now the second, second state of I is called what? Nearest point. What another name of this nearest point? Your eye will be relaxed. Huh? Your eye will be highly strained. Definitely you will question me, sir. Convince me uh, why, sir, strained eye. I will tell you. It is also called a strained eye also. Nearest point also. Means if you see this, this is a focal point. This is a optic center. This is a object. Your light ray will go to the point of focus and uh, where the light rays will meet, respond. Kindly respond where the light rays will meet uh, at the 25 centimeter or capital D. Are you understanding, students? So your eye will be highly strained. You can't even see more than 10 seconds also. Tearing, tearing will start. Understood. Continuously for a very near 25 centimeter continuously if you see means what will happen? Definitely your eye will be strained like anything. Most of the people uh, that's what librarian scientists, it, especially biological scientists, they have to watch microorganisms. Definitely everyone will have the spectacle strengths. Are you understanding? But drivers, they don't have the spectacle. Have you noticed that? Huh? Why drivers always their eye will be relaxed. They have to see the far points only. Have you noticed the professional drivers? No one will have the DNA problem is different. This is an artificial problem because when you see continuously for a nearest object, your eye will be strained and so it will be uh, rectified, it will be corrected. But most of the drivers, they do not have any spectacles. Aged people, I am not talking. Correct or not? Why? Because they have to see the far point. Your, their eye will be always in the relaxed state only. Understood? Okay? They nicely play the music and they will drive. Have you noticed? Huh? Especially private traveler, bus driver, you see, they will enjoy. Okay? Now, where you have to keep your image, tell me. You will question me definitely, sir. Convince me uh, why we are, why our eye is getting strained, sir. Okay. For that, uh, one should know the one should know the eye alignment. One should know. If you see the eye alignment, eye eye alignment. If you see eye is one one spherical ball, not a exactly spherical, slightly oval shape is there. Nothing is perfect sphere, na? Correct or not? Here in front, uh, one co natural convex lens is there. It is connected with one ciliary muscles in all directions. Are you understanding? When you are seeing any very far image, what will happen? Your eye lens size will be increased. The beauty of the nature you see, your convex lens kept in your eye, it can be increased its size and it can be decreased its size also. Say, sir, no. When you are seeing any very far object, very far image, what will happen? This lens size will be increased. Na? Kindly say, sir, no. This lens size is increased means the ciliary muscles will be relaxed. The ciliary muscles are contracted. Contracted means what? Relaxed state only. Na? 
that's what when you are seeing any far object the size of the lens i'll write down that point when we are seeing when we are seeing far images or objects far objects is wrong statement only na are you seeing objects ah images wrong no one will see objects image. only image only they will see so already I proved also we are seeing real images and virtual images only are understanding student so when we are seeing far or images when we are seeing far or images what will happen to the lens size lens size will increase lens size increases means what will happen to ciliary muscles come on respond ciliary muscles will be contracted na correct or not muscle when it is strained when is elongated only you will get pain no generally uh, children people will complain that headache 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 actually it is not headache students it is a optic nerve is there na when you are seeing continuously actually you have to blink the eye continuously if you study also uh, seriously some people stop blinking are you understanding and unknowingly they will put the objects very closer and they will see and they were they are thinking that headache headache that is not headache actually that is a extension of this optic nerve only I'm sorry not ciliary muscles so the ciliary muscles are getting elongated like a rubber band what will happen pain will start and this eye eye muscles also connected to the this uh, muscular system near the head so that is not actually headache are you understanding student that uh, if you pronounce no problem but for that solution not a paracetamol or headache tablet you have to leave the book and you have to go outside and you have to watch the farer things like farer building farer flying uh, birds why birds flying for you only you should go and watch are you understanding correct or not ma 10 minutes you watch are you understanding then you come that uh, ache will go your ciliary muscles come back to its uh, normal state then again with the same rejuvenation you can study continue your self study are you understanding student like uh, agitation you should not study understood strategically understood you have to study for every 40 minutes you have to give the break 10 minutes 15 minutes at least are you understanding okay i hope you people understood why what is the concept of the headache what is the elongation of the ciliary muscle why i will be relaxed when you are seeing for a vice versa also true no when you are watching a nearest object what will happen students your eye lens will become very small na then the ciliary muscles will be stretched like a rubber band correct or not correct or not continuously if you uh, see like that they may cut off also they may collapse also are understanding your eye may be fail to magnify i mean change the size are understanding students okay so imagining. you are imagining okay so like that that's what uh, when you are seeing any uh, nearest image at the near point what is the state of that eye is called here respond strained eye in this thing what will happen the size of the lens will decrease size of the lens decreases means what here focal length also will decrease so what happened to the ciliary muscles kindly respond to the ciliary muscles what will happen they will elongate ciliary muscle will elongate expanding means that is a different meaning they will elongate so that's so that will give a lot of pain students okay so that is a that's what we are calling uh, relaxed eye or strained eye okay now we will come to our subject what is that subject is what visual angle with the aid visual angle with aid that is denoted with the symbol theta i 
this is your simple microscope students okay this is a principal axis this is a point of focus optic center where you have to keep your object kindly respond between optic center and focal point one parallel ray of light will fall where it will go where it will go ma at point of focus when a ray of light is coming at the optic center where it will go here say sir no where image is formed respond at nearest point understood or not understood say sir no students so here visual angle means this angle how much is there this angle also same no so with your permission shall i write visual angle theta equal to how much here students height of the object okay by what here height of the i mean the least distance of distinct vision no says or no correct or not so i can write height of the object by d i can write sorry wait a second mm -hmm. wait a second wait a second height of the this is you know visual angle is what here height of this is height of the object and by u without aid without aid tell me without aid i mean with your direct naked eye when you are seeing the object it should be at the least distance di distinct vision no? correct or not so what is the visual angle here theta o what a theta o value height of the object by least distance of distinct vision at least correct or not to see the image visual angle means compulsory that object must be placed at capital d so then what is the magnification equal to students respond magnification equal to visual angle with aid by visual angle without aid very very important formula i am requesting all to remember at your fingertips photographic memory theta i value how much height of the object by u divided by how much height of the object by capital d ho ho cancels out so what a magnification power or magnification of the simple microscope d by u direct questions will come students in your j double e paper very powerful formula memory is only important what situation what formula you have to select that only important student i am telling is my point clear okay now okay now how many states are there students tell me as i told you as i discussed you image must form between how many points two points in between nearest point so first point is what strained eye we will discuss which i strained eye we will see strained eye uh, means strained eye means what where image is formed respond at nearest point it should form means this is a lens this is a point of focus where object is placed kindly respond at you where image is formed where image is formed students compulsory at d no say sir no what a u value here minus u plus u object distance minus u what image distance kindly respond minus d what a focal length of the lens plus f only na which form i have to use 1 by f equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u 1 by f value how much plus f and 1 by v minus d minus u value how much minus u so 1 by f equal to how much minus 1 by d plus 1 by u understood i want d by u only na magnification power so for that i will multiply with d here d here d here 
dd cancels out so d by f equal to how much here minus 1 plus d by u understood huh? so d by u is nothing but what here friend 1 plus d by f so this is a magnification power when the image is formed at nearest point how much formula d by u r 1 plus capital d by f students i'm requesting you all kindly remember at your fingertips is my point clear huh? so that is nearest point is over what's up next four point only na second state of i what is second state of i four point to accomplish the image at four point i mean infinity compulsory where you have to keep your object tell me students compulsory at point of focus you have to keep correct huh? so that image will be formed at infinity understood or not understood so u value how much minus f focal length value plus f and uh, image distance how much friends undefined no says or no what a formula 1 by f equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u 1 by f equal to and uh, i mean 1 by infinity means 0 and minus 1 by f i mean what a magnification when image is formed at undefined. How much? D by U only. But U value, how much I have to keep here? Respond, U value, how much? I am requesting what object is done here, students? F only, na? so D by F. This is a magnification when image is formed at infinity. But actually... Do you say always image will form at two points only? Yeah? In between, somewhere also it can form. No? Kindly say yes or no. Say yes or no. In such case, what will happen? Let us see third state. If image is formed in between. If image is formed in between. What and what? In between near point and which point? Respond. Far point. So this is a convex lens where object should be placed students. Somewhere here you where image will form somewhere V. Now tell me what a U value minus U. What a V value minus V. F value plus F. What a formula lens formula respond. 1 by f equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u. So 1 by f equal to minus 1 by v minus into minus how much? Plus 1 by u. I want d by u only. Na? Magnification formula how much my dear friends? I want d by u only. Na? On either side I will multiply with d and d and d. This value if you bring this side what do you get? Respond. d by u equal to how much? d by f plus d by u. So what a magnification at the average point or uh, any in between point uh, d must be taken outside or d if you take outside how much? 1 by f plus 1 by u. Okay. Sorry, 1 by v, no? Sorry, sorry. Printing mistake. 1 by v students. I am requesting you all this both three formulas kindly remember at your fingertips. Uh, okay. So before going to exam hall, not only now, uh, not only in the exam hall, now in the future also, I mean now, compound microscope also, I am going to execute directly. Okay. Clear up. Just I am briefly revising this three formula. When image is formed at infinity, what are magnification? D by F only. Now if magnification is formed at nearest point, how much? 1 plus d by f that's all easy to remember when image is formed nearest point means magnification is very bigger no that's what one extra will come when image is formed at infinity means what one will not come so easy to remember this uh, in instances but uh, do you depend on the one lens one convex lens you cannot accomplish much magnification no 
if you want to see one microorganism one convex lens is sufficient ah huh? if you want to see one bacteria is it sufficient ah huh? that's what multiple convex lenses we will keep the combination correct or not if two lenses you are keeping means magnification of total two lenses how much magnification of first lens into magnification of second lens are you understanding so that's what by adding by using multiple number of convex lenses okay you can magnify that microorganism what is the use of the microscope students tell me to read the fonts in your book and in your newspaper and uh, uh, for scientist to see the small small things one convex lens is sufficient correct or not but to observe the for a technician lab technician biological lab technician do you say that single convex lens sufficient ah is is it sufficient it is not sufficient why because with the convex lens he is unable to magnify that image he totally fails that's what what is the solution you have to add more number of lens so more than one convex lens is used that microscope is called what here compounding microscope or compound microscope first let me introduce the uh, construction of the compounding or compound microscope it has how many lenses totally two convex lens one is having very smaller focal length that is called objective lens why i am calling objective lens it is placed near the object it is placed near that uh, micro organism and another lens is called eye lens e means what here students eye lens why it is called eye lens that is very close to your eye it is called eye lens and here focal length of the objective lens is very very smaller than focal length of the eye lens and what is the magnification of the two lenses product of magnification of the objective lens into magnification of how much eye lens okay so that's what have you noticed the magnification will be multiplied are you understanding now now students as i told you how many possibilities of images will be formed respond first is what i am requesting you all what is the first one near point or what another name strained eye just uh, see this this is one which lens objective lens o means what objective lens and i lens also placed coaxially like this okay here somewhere object type placed o means what object one ray of light will fall like this on ray of light falling at optic center it won't uh, uh, deviate due to objective lens where first image will form real image will form in between somewhere no says or no what is the distance here called object distance uo what is the distance is called image distance vo understood mm. now this image i1 is acting like a object for i lens na no? now you forget totally objective lens now i lens for i lens which is object students I1, I1. this i1 is acting like a object so that object distance is called ue and one ray of light will fall how it will go compulsory it should pass us through the focal point of i lens here also this is focal point of objective lens and one ray of light falling at optic center uh it will go like this without a deviation here a diagram sometimes will fail students so yeah, what i will yeah. do they should not meet they should diverge like this 
understanding of here this is the focal point of the islands have you seen the final emanating refracted light do the do they meet students no, they do not meet so the final image final image have you noticed highly magnified na have you noted student i2 prime is highly magnified no can you say yes or no now tell me what is the total magnification formula magnification of the where the final image is formed see the title i'm requesting all what is the image distance final image compulsory d so now here tell me what is the magnification equal to <clears throat> magnification of objective lens into magnification of the eye lens what a magnification due to objective lens students image distance by object distance only na no? yes. say sir no this is eye lens is already our simple microscope na no? understood or not understood concept i am unable to see the bacteria that's what i kept this extra lens understood or not with this only simple microscope i can just read the fonts in newspaper understood uh, fonts in some micro sculptures are there na no? you know micro sculpture micro artist will be there na no? rice taj mahal and rice grain charminar like that they will paint they will sculpt understood so to see that kind of micro level uh, arts we have to use this simple simple microscope but uh, in the room many micro organisms are there bacteria virus is there na no? how will you see them that's what i added this extra lens for understanding so tell me what the magnification of this simple microscope students already ready made formula is there when simple microscope image is formed at least distance of distinct vision one formula is there what is that tell me 1 plus d by f e i am requesting you all kindly remember at your fingertips this two lenses must be placed in one enclosed chamber that is called length of the tube only na say sir no what length of the tube here a tube length you not you is the tube. tube length of the uh, compounded microscope how much vo plus ue if you want to adjust students you can adjust as per your data given in the numerical understood everyone is it clear students say yes sir no now near point is completed what's up next four point we have to investigate that four point also what another name of the four point four point another name is what students relaxed eye sometimes it is called normal adjustment position also for understanding up if you uh, review the diagram is a convex lens what is this con vex lens this is what principal axis where you have to keep the object students respond somewhere image will form na kindly say yes or no real image must form i1 what the object distance your uo and what are the image distance of the objective lens vo i decided to form the final image at infin infinite this image i1 acting like a object for convex lens no i lens no compulsory where i have to place this i1 okay. at at focal point of the i lens no say yes or no then only the final image will be formed at uh, infinite one parallel ray of light is falling how it will go at the focal point and one ray of light falling at this optic center it goes straight only correct or not so where the final image will form 
रेस्पॉन्ड फ्रेंड्स इनफिनिटी ओनली ना सेसर नो नो टेल मी व्हाट इज द मैग्निफिकेशन हियर स्टूडेंट्स व्हाट इज द मैग्निफिकेशन इन द सिनेरियो मैग्निफिकेशन ऑफ द ऑब्जेक्टिव लेंस एंड magnification of the objective lens and magnification of the eye lens what a magnification of the objective lens vo by u or no as usually what a magnification of the eye lens at uh, infinite point ready made formula is there what is that only d by f only na says or no i'll substitute here d by fe very powerful formula so direct questions will come understood ah okay now what is the tube length respond tube length means what distance between the eye lens and objective lens how much that equal to vo plus fe okay depends on the situation you might need to change this equation also is my point clear huh? but uh, overall everyone should have the diagram drawing skills also okay third point where is there any rule that compulsory image should form at uh, only uh, at a lddv i mean is there any rule i it should form only at near point and only far point is there any rule ah? there is no such rule no so if you see any uh, in between point in between where and where point in between where and where students point in between near point and np and fp correct ah if you see that this is a objective lens and what a name of the lens i lens where they have been placed coaxially <clears throat> here object is there one light is coming like this is passing through focal point of the objective lens one is going without deviation here image i1 is there this is a image distance vo object distance how much uo here object distance ue and uh, one ray of light will fall it should go compulsory to the focal point of i lens uh, and one more ray of light will go like this where they will meet i prime some v now tell me what is the magnification power students magnification of the objective lens into magnification of the eye lens what is the magnification of the objective lens vo by u o no say yes or no what is the magnification of the eye lens v by u e what a tube length what a tube length i am asking how much vo plus u e only no this is called tube length definitely you will ask me sir if i watch this compound microscope na sir that image will be inverted only na have you noticed all images all final images are inverted only na that's what you cannot notice you cannot diagnose properly or understanding friend okay that's what uh, one more lens they will introduce if you introduce in between one more lens that lens is called erecting lens what is the role of the erecting lens students erecting lens erecting lens means that uh, inverted image it will make erected above the principal axis so that uh, lab technician will see the correct uh, orientation of that uh, microorganism or bacteria so correct uh, doctor will diagnose correctly correct or not say sir no if tv bacteria like this if it is inverted means he will think that that is a, a typhoid bacteria correct or not so diagnosis is important correct or not tb bacteria entered but you gave the prescribed typhoid bacteria medicine means you just imagine correct or not so that patient body the doctor is using as a 
experimental laboratory correct or not so that's what properly uh, it should be diagnosed that's what one more lens also will be introduced what the name of the lens electric lens where it is introduced in between the two lenses the, such so that image will be automatically erected and uh, that person will observe the correct image understood yeah. so this is the concept of the compounding microscope i hope you all understood very nicely what a compounding microscope so what is the last but not least telescope are you copying ah huh? Zoom out, ah, zoom in. Ora. Now, uh, as of now, what we discussed, how to we focused on the magnification only. like microorganisms small fonts small sculpture how to magnify by using the two lenses but now we are one uh, space scientist what is our job right now space we have to see the celestial bodies interstellar bodies like planet stars definitely we are living in the planet mean definitely in the space definitely this kind of planets millions and trillions will be there correct or not you should be cautious always into the space if any aliens are coming uh, you have to monitor correct or not you means not you that scientist job that only if any uh, thing comes means it may invade and it may it may attack you correct or not so with the neighborhood we won't be a properly so the creature coming from the other planet how it will make friendship to you that that's what compulsory you have to monitor very closely that alien need not to be a human being and big size it may be micro organism also correct or not friend so it is not a casual issue it is a serious matter only correct or not that's what okay so compulsory you need one powerful telescope which you can see the farer objects so that makes visible very nearer to you so what the name of that instrument is called students here telescope or astronomical telescope what the name of that telescope just shall i write with your permission this is a reciprocal of the microscope shall i write ah huh? why i am calling because microscope means the micro organism is there so the accommodation is very less the size of the object is very less na that's what i used very smaller objective lens focal length is very small na the power of accommodation is very less but right now you are seeing total space no so that's what objective lens side should be it should accommodate more number of light rays no are you understanding what i am saying what is the necessity 
to make the size of the object lens is very smaller you are seeing very very smaller objects so that power of accommodation is very little that's what smaller size smaller aperture is enough but in telescope you are watching big big objects like sun moon not only in our solar family outer galaxy also we are seeing mean that uh, power of accommodation is very big mean that size of the aperture of the lens should be very big or no say sir that's what that is the major difference between telescope and the microscope so the telescope should have the very larger aperture or uh, very larger focal length and uh, what about this very small eye lens comparing with how they place i'm asking you how do they place i am asking you how do they place tell me coaxially they will place i mean they having the common axis one any from far object one ray of light is coming it goes straight it, when it falls at the optic center any ray of light is coming like this what will happen something is falling at the focal point of object lens how it will go goes parallel say sir no so they will meet uh, one real image only will form na no? kindly say sir no yes, sir. so where the image will be formed if the object is infinite means where exactly image will form my dear friends focal length only na no? kindly say sir no yes. say sir no next image i1 is acting like a object for eye lens na no? understanding or not understanding so again ah huh? how on the focal length is object is infinity na no? no, focal length of the object lens f only na no? object is infinity na no? jiva no. object is infinity means focal image will be at focal yes, point only na no? okay object is infinity na no? students okay kindly remember that point and uh, here what object distance ue how it will go like this it is a focal point of the eye lens and uh, should go straightly kindly some adjustment is required final image because they should be diverged like this is a focal point of the eye lens do they meet really final image they never meet so this is a final image friends sorry final image is virtual image na please don't use that continuous line friends because okay. outside people will ask you who taught you physics understood real image means continuous line are you understanding student virtual image means what dotted line discontinuous lines we have to use are you getting my point okay first directly we are analyzing which point nearest point we will analyze which point respond which point we will analyze nearest point we will analyze no object is at object is infinity means final image you have to adjust that two points na no? nearest point and far point here i adjusted the final image i prime at the nearest point what is wrong with me understood now or tell me what is the visual angle of the object student this is only visual angle of the object na no? correct or not this is visual angle of object mean this is also visual angle of object na no? what is the visual angle of the object let's say this is h with your permission shall i write visual angle of the object equal to how much opposite side h by adjacent side fo have you seen this right angle triangle yes, kindly focus this is a visual angle of the object where is visual angle of the image this this one in a visual angle of image 
Visual angle of image, how much here? Theta equal to how much? Visual angle of the image equal to? Same. Watch this again, this right angle triangle. H by UE only, na? Then what is the magnification power in this situation? I'm requesting all, what is the magnification power here? Magnification of the objective lens and magnification of the eye lens. What a magnification of objective lens? Response friends. Or uh, here we don't need to use magnification formula. How much? Visual angle of image by visual angle of object. What a visual angle of image? H by UE whole divided by H by FE. HH cancels out. So what a magnification power formula? F. Sorry, this is FO, no? FO by UE. I'm requesting all kindly remember the formula for magnification of the telescope. But now we have to apply for nearest point. For which point we have to apply first point? Nearest point. This is nearest point. I deduced this formula. This is not nearest point. So first case again I am repeating. Man. Again, you are uh, again I am repeating. Understood? This is I deduced the magnification formula. This is called general formula for magnification. General formula for magnification of telescope. Formula for magnification of telescope. Now you focus on eye lens. For focus, what is the object distance, students? Minus UE only, no? Say, sir, no. Eye lens only you focus. Object distance, how much? Minus UE. Where is image distance? Minus capital D only, no? Correct me, object me if I am wrong. What a focal length of the eye lens? Plus F E only no. Which formula I have to use? 1 by F e equal to 1 by V minus 1 by U. 1 by F E equal to how much? 1 by minus D minus 1 by U E. What a 1 by U E value strengths? Minus 1 by D send this side. So 1 by F E plus 1 by capital D equal to 1 by U E. So what is the magnification when image is formed at a nearest point? In the place of 1 by UE, shall I put here this formula? Understanding or not understanding? Really understood or not understood? So I am requesting again, remember. Now, now near point is over. What's up next? Far point. Far point. So this is the objective lens. Uh, you you know my number, huh? Once text me. You have my number, no? You text me, sir. This is my number. This is Prachand. This is Darun. Like that. I will add. Now mobile phone and it's charging. I will thank add. You. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank. You. Now far point means. Four point, shall I slide huh, like this? Four point means, please, this uh, diagram drawing skills are very important. This is the objective lens. And as I told you, from the farer object, light rays will fall like this. Who are falling at optic center, they will deviate. Huh? They will deviate. Huh? They do not deviate. One more ray of light falling through the focal point of objective lens. How it will go? Parallel only, no? Say, sir, no. So, where the real image will form? At focal point of objective lens only, no? Say, sir, no. Then again, I1 is acting like an object, no? Kindly say, sir, no. It, uh, I lens, one ray of light coming here, how it will go? 
how it will go it must go through the focal point of eye lens na yes, and one more ray of light it should go like this so but uh, you have to adjust uh, something compulsory the light rays should be parallel no this is a point of focus so here the image final image should be formed where at infinity so now tell me what is the formula magnification per eye line whole over 2 minutes no see exactly 2 minutes is there. it is about ten eye lines what is the u value for eye lines image is at infinity means that i1 should be formed where students compulsory at focal length of the eye lines na no? yes. sir no so u value minus fe where is the final image infinity it will form what a focal length plus fe which formula i have to use 1 by fe equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u 1 by f value how much fe 1 by v value minus 1 by infinity minus u value minus fe understood mm. so substitute what is the magnification formula fo by ue na ue i mean object distance what i have to put compulsory fe only na so magnification when it formed at infinity fo by fe students so is a important formula and what are tube length tube length fo plus fe i forgot to mention here at nearest point what are tube length fo plus ue fo plus ue okay students so that's all time over and ray optics also over tomorrow ray optics jiva hmm. Okay, friends. Thank you. We'll meet tomorrow. Bye.